And, okay, getting into it. Starting on Battlefield. And... Hmm. Oh, wow. Okay. That was a good conversion. That, uh... Oh, man. Yeah, that forward smash got a weird angle, but he still covered. But the dare wasn't strong. And now staying at a good percent. Fetch just not really getting that too many openings. Um, barely lived with that uppy angle a bit earlier, but... It can be tough to get in, man, against Valko. But... Okay. Oh, no. I think he wanted to get something, and now Bar's getting started. A trade. Oh, wow. Down smash? Cover tech in. And, oh, that laser. Oh, no dare. Huh. Okay. Uh, that was, like, that was, like, probably the most, like, Falco, I'm gonna, you know, just, like, lay top dare of all time, but able to make it work. I'm still living. Oh, my God. Uh, still living. And there, yeah, okay. Not ready for it. And now, part up. Okay. Oh, not able to get in much off the shine. Oh, that gadget tag, actually. I think that may have been a bit of spaghetti, but it actually makes it work, covering the instant illusion. Oh, just a grab. And... They covered pretty low. Okay, actually able to make it back onto stage and hit the tech, but barred coverage. Oh, down smash. <laughs> Again, just goes for it in neutral. Oh! Oh, well, <laughs> he was actually, that uppy was actually very smart. Uh, because he was looking for, like, up air. This is weird. And... Firefox beat it out, but still. Yeah, Bard looking pretty good. I think just, like, a lot in neutral, he's, I mean, really, like, getting his openings, whereas Fetch not looking to capitalize. Like, not, I guess, capitalizing as hard. Oh, wow. All those lasers were pinpoint accuracy. Every single vertical you know <laughs> everywhere fedge was there was a laser right in his face from bard so now game two um what foxes like fd depending on how much they like the chain grab but you know fd i feel like from pretty much most characters just like reduces the amount of openings you need but they are going to Fod. Pick more of a anti Falco pick than a pro Fox pick. Um, definitely, obviously, a lot more, you know, I guess, improv based with the um, plats and whatnot. I mean, Falco can trick you up. I mean, a lot of the dares from side plat lowered can be like hard to get up from, but oh wow, that was actually pretty good. Oh, actually, great tech on the shine. Fetch Tarek covering, but does not get the Nair hitbox he wants. Oh, just the missed ledge dash from Bard. Fetch, I mean, punish-wise, looking pretty good on that first stock, too. Using Shine a lot more, I see, but... Oh, just up smashes again. A third time. Looking for it so hard. Yeah, up throw up smash. It's like... And right now, Fetch is looking really good on this game, too. I mean, that game one, I, I wouldn't say it was, like, super duper in Bard's favor, but it just kind of looked like Fetch could not get very much started. Whereas here, I mean, it looks kind of the opposite. Okay, that was really great stuff from Bard, though. Covering the mistech with the down smash. And now... Oh! An up tilt to get out. This is where Fog comes in. Oh, no shine shield. Oh, we fared from ledge. That's going to close out the stock. 
And we'll see if Bard can overcome like a slow start to this game too, or Edge goes up. Oh! Oh, he just goes out and airs. I don't know what he was looking for, but definitely not that. Oh, the bit's shortened. And gets the up smash. And now Bard on his last stock of this game. Oh, man. Oh, I was looking for it. Okay, back air. Is this going to close it out? Oh, no. Goes for dash attack. Dude, these high dares on shield. You can see how much Bard is fishing for this back air. Okay, able to get it there. Fetch with it, breathe in. He knows how important this game too is. Oh. Oh, they're taking place. And. Oh my god. Shine Bear. Oh, just. And now Bard. Oh, the Firefox doesn't get punished. Oh no, he's off there. Oh, the shine. I can't believe that didn't hit. Is that? Oh, that's not it. Dude. What? How are these guys not dead? He went so low. Oh, he drills. Oh my God, that's it. Fetch takes it. Oh my God. What a close game. Shaking his head. I mean, there's some spaghetti from both of those guys last stock, but oh my God. Fetch, Fetch taking that game too. I mean, he started off super hot, but it really looked like Bard was applying a lot of pressure. Okay, going to Pokemon here. <laughs> yeah, definitely, uh, you know, even with transitions, I would say, um, yeah, definitely pretty flat classic, I guess you could say, Falco counterpick. Even though I think uh, low ceiling means, I mean, a lot of these up smashes may be killing at earlier percents, but the space, black like top platform, thought it was gonna be liking that. Oh, oh wow, okay, okay, okay. That's actually the second time Bard has done that where he's covered Fedge's tech on the platform and then just like covered the instant side B with the down smash. That's really great uh, coverage. I love to see players doing that. It's like stuff with the Ams attack where you do an F smash at the ledge and they will on stack and you just do it again. Just like that next level coverage. And right now Bard's heating up. Seki like misses, but again, a lot of these down smashes. Actually, first power shields we've seen in like all game for Veg. Yeah, Bard not using a lot of lasers. I think in neutral, just really going in with a lot of these like hitboxes, a lot of dares and whatnot. But. You know, using it, I think, sparingly, I would say. No windmill coming in. Oh, great tech chase. Okay, the platform making it a little weird, but the shield drop bear going to get it for Fedge. Just hanging out on the windmill. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure about that. Was well, Fedge, I guess, like getting a little caught in the corner. And now, I mean, nah, we had that close game too, but this is looking a lot closer to game one. Oh man. And well, not yet. Oh, is that? Oh, it actually goes for bear there. Oh, okay. Yep, this is gonna close it out. Now. Moving on to game four. We'll see where Fedge wants to go. Fountain of Dreams is off the table, but can run it back to Battlefield. I don't think so. I think we will be seeing FD. Um, I think FD Dreamland and Bats are really the only stages he would want to go. Obviously, lost on Bats. Dreamland can kind of be a mix, and then if he likes the chain grab, he might go FD. Okay, is going to run it back on Battlefield. So this is where we saw game one, and was pretty, 
Falco favored, but again, the same stages that like Fox likes, Falco generally likes. So in the matchup stages aren't super duper duper important. Cause like even like on the FD with the chain grab, Falco still gets to like, um, like a lot more punish as well. No platforms interrupt. So I was just looking for these. How many bears can he do on a shield? Okay. Oh, just great spot dodge. Far shaking his head, knowing missing these conversions will cost him. Oh yeah, and now Bart letting Fedge live again. But okay. Finally cleaning that up there. Fedge not Fedge nodding, knowing he can take the stock pretty quickly. And he does there. Back to even. Okay. Oh, that up smash is barely missing. Oh my god, he's been going for so many of these. Oh, we're seeing some tech clubs. Could be some nerves. Oh no, you never want to see a tournament winner like that. Oh, again. Oh, you know, Fedge. Yeah, not happy. You do not want to see those. Fart up a little bit, but... Okay. Bunch of up tilts. Oh! Okay. Fart's still not able to convert into a stock. Fedge getting some extra chance to live. Oh my god, up tilt shine? Uh, yeah, again, both these guys having a lot of trouble, I feel like, really getting the stock. A lot of fishing. I feel like flow charts for both these guys are being a little spaghetti. Oh, it's a tech. Oh! Okay, Gap finds it! And now Fedge with such a quick stock. But. I'm barred here to open it. Okay, okay. Last stock here on game four. Is Bard going to make it into losers finals? Face off against Hoder or hmm, is Fedge gonna bring this to game five? Oh, the ladder combo. That's a lot of percent now. A lot of things will just send Fox off stage. Down smash. Almost hitting. Our shield. Oh, how did that shield get miss? Oh no, but Fedge. Oh, the shine. This is such spaghetti, dude. Oh, both these characters are gonna die. Oh my god, <laughs> dude. <laughs> okay, they're coming out. Oh, dinner. and that's gonna do it. Yep. Fedge a little upset, but. Still a pretty good, um, I think, showing from both these guys. Fedge, I feel like, definitely came alive. Definitely in that uh, second game, as well as that fourth game. Uh, definitely had a shot to take that. So, um, Bard very good as well. So, good showing from him making it into Losers Finals. Versus another Fox, which we 